paying for? Hello and welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video we're going to be targeting one of the shark species that we have here in Ireland called the taupe. Uh, taupe is kind of the, the mid-range shark species. The, we're targeting kind of 20 to 50 pounds range that's basically what we're going to be targeting uh, the best thing to do when you are targeting dope is have fresh bait so at the start of the video we'll be going and we'll be looking for mackerel to use as bait so we'll look for mackerel and then we'll head out for taupe when we're out there we'll show you the rigs that we use both for catching the mackerel and for catching the taupe uh, it is very exciting because we do have a date with a glamorous lady so it should be all good if this is your first time to the channel please subscribe to the channel you'll be able to see the other videos that we have and any new videos that come out and if you do like the video after you watch it or while you're watching it just give it a big thumbs up it'll really help out the channel so we'll go now and we'll have a look see how we got on Halfway down, then you can catch them. And there's a few there. That's very lucky now that we've just got them. So there we are. Let's help catch mackerel for bait. feel like mackerel. It's probably a cold fish or maybe a pollock or cod or something like that. Oh, a pollock, a nice pollock. Lovely pollock, maybe about a pound or so. Lovely, we'll keep him for the taupe fishing today. So, for the taupe, what we have is we have a run and boom with a 10 ounce lead on it, it just runs. That's on a shock leader just to protect the braided line that we have. And then we have a couple of feet of steel wire, I think it's probably about, about 70 pound strength, maybe. And then at the business end, we have a 10 ounce hook. And what we use is just for then is we put the mackerel on. This is the mackerel we caught earlier. Uh, we do mackerel flappers and I'll show you how to do that now. So basically all you want to do, all you're doing is you're really just taking out the backbone. So what you want to do is just above the backbone and then cut it down along the backbone. Same with the other side. away and that'll feed the seagulls and all you do then is you get this hook here and then just put it through the head right through 
and there we are all nicely open and fresh mackerel plenty of juice and we'll see we should be able to get a tope on that so you saw us we used the mackerel flapper for the tope so this is a different type of trace the same situation with the the sliding bill keep it on the bottom and then we have about three or four feet of 40 pound line with ending the 4 -0 hook sorry a 3 -0 hook and what we're going to do is we're going to use prawns and we're going to try and catch some smooth hound maybe so all we do is we just put it in through the tail and we straighten it out just so that the, the hook is sticking out there that way you see and then we keep it straight and we get some elastic thread which you can buy in any tackle shop and you just thread it on and that keeps it all in place put it all on make sure it doesn't fall off so there we go that's our bait for our try and catch a smooth out so we put this in now and we'll see how we get on this is what we got on the tope rig it's a greater spotted dogfish or a bull hus. it's not what we wanted but uh, it's a fish all the same it just doesn't want to come in Enjoy that.
that's what we came here for today. Let's hope this one is 161 centimeters long, the girt of 59, saying maybe 44, between 45 to 50 pounds of weight. Brilliant, Irish specimen help, lovely stuff. You just put on. Another coat on it. Spotted dogfish. Lovely. These here are very aggressive, but their their skin is peculiar because if you from head to tail it's all smooth, but then if you go the other way, it's like sandpaper. So if you catch one be careful of your skin because they can rasp you and take your skin away. Okay. Lovely, we'll, we'll get them back. Okay, so the rod with the oh, calm down. The rod with the prongs on it, we got a small smooth hound. A starry smooth hound few pounds just but it's a different species there we go lovely we we'll just get them back Gone. okay we have another tow on not as big as the last one Caught on the macro flapper. I showed you how to do earlier on. He's only barely hooked in his mouth, so let's see if we manage to get him in. Small but strong. To put them straight back in. We might be able to see him go. Done. Lovely. Go for it, John.
that's it for today. Uh, we had a good day. We got the target species, which was tow. So we had a couple of tow. We had some smooth hound. We had some bull huss and dogfish. And earlier on, we had lots of mackerel for bait. And we kept some. We kept a couple of pollock down for for the table for later. So that's it. Another good day out fishing. So we'll see you the next time that fishy field goes fishing.